Okay, so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to take mockups and put them into Dreamweaver. So I already have my mockups here. I'm going to go ahead and export this. We're going to go to File, Export, and we're going to save it as PNG. And it doesn't matter the name. Also, you want to create a folder, which I put mockups and assets. And this is going to help you keep your organization clean, simple, and very easy. And you don't have to name this. You, you could in yours, so you know which one you're working on. Okay, so I'm just going to hit Save. Yeah, okay, it doesn't matter this information because these are again mockups. And now we're going to go to our Dream Mover. We're going to hit Site, Manage Sites, and we're going to create a new one if we have to. We're going to go ahead and create that. But if you were to, you would say Site Name, and then you link the folder that we're working on, which is mockups. But because I already have it, I'm just going to use mine and go ahead, click on mine, and then hit Done. Now I'm going to go ahead and create a new file and name it index index.html here and the reason we want to do that is because if your website doesn't start with index.html at least your main page or one of your pages doesn't have index.html then it's not going to be redirected to this website and it's also going to be not it's not going to be hacker proof so this gives you a little bit more uh, a little bit better the ability to protect yourself. So now that we did that, we're going to go to site. We're going to, I mean, we're going to go window, um, work at space layout, and click classic because this is probably not set to that. And we click cl classic, and then we see this design. We're going to go. We're going to use these on the layout tab. We're going to use this draw AP div. We're going to go ahead and click on that and start drawing. And there you have it. Okay, so now inside of here, we're going to go to common. We're going to go to images. We're going to place an image in here and here we go we have the um, mockup that we created that I didn't name now here's the same thing you don't have to name it because this is just a mockup you're just going to be using this to place as a placeholder we're going to hit ok and there you have it your mockup and now when we save it we're going to hit I'm going to hit F12 or just to show you you're going to click here preview in Chrome which is the default web browser Whatever browser you have, and then you hit save, and there you have it. Now we're going to place a top logo, news updates, hot links, people, copyright. So now that we have our mock up and the page done, we're going to do the same thing. I rather like to use AP divs. We're going to draw an AP div right above that, and there you go. And now we can place that image or whatever you, you're working with right there, and the same thing for the rest of the things like the news and updates the same thing and the best thing about this is that you can move these around so let's say I created this here and I'm like oh no uh, just it's a, so close to the right I can use the arrow keys or I can use the mouse to move it over and I can also readjust this and the same thing as I go on and create more and more and more and that's pretty much it thank you